Good afternoon, and welcome to Newport's historic Washington Square. My name's Liz Drayton, and I am patron relations at the Opera House Theatre and Newport Performing Arts Centre, and I will be your tour guide today as we take a fly through the Opera House Theatre in the midst of its fabulous restoration. What we have behind us here is the proscenium arch from the 1929 restoration of the Opera House. And flanking the arch on either side are the organ bays where the organ pipes from the mighty Wolitzer organ were located. You'll see behind me the wonderful volume of the Opera House Theatre. When it was built in 1867, it sat 1,000 people. When it was done as a cinema palace in 1929, it sat 1,000 people. And as we redo it as the Newport Performing Arts Center, it'll seat 700 people, with about 550 people at the orchestra level and another 150 people in the balcony. So here we are in the newly installed orchestra pit. So this will be a tri-level lift. When it's at ground level, it's an orchestra pit. When it comes up to floor level, it will be equal with the floor and allow us to put in additional seating. And when it's up at its third level, it's a stage extension, which gives us additional depth to the stage and great flexibility on our stage. So here we are in our newly configured upstairs lobby space. In the 1867 building, these were hotel rooms overlooking Washington Square. We've removed all of the walls of the hotel rooms to create this nice new wide open space and gone through this load-bearing wall to connect it to the old, beautifully vaulted ceilinged interior lobby space. So now we have a very substantial second floor lobby space to accommodate all of the guests here at the Opera House. Here we are in our reconfigured balcony. What you're seeing here is the framework for the new seating in the balcony, where we've changed the rake of the balcony so that all of the seats enjoy a clear view down to the nose of the extended stage. Here we can see a great example of the integration of the new construction, with some of the old uh, structural supports within the building. Behind us are these beautiful orange beams that were part of the 1929 restoration of the Opera House back in the Age of Steel. And right above them are the gray super beams that we've put in as structural supports to the fourth floor, which will be our rooftop conservatory and terrace. Through these doors are an example of the old hotel rooms that used to front the Hopper House on the second, third, and fourth floors. Uh, we will be restoring these hotel rooms on the third floor here into office space, maintaining the historic character and fabric and the original floorboards that were part of the original hotel rooms as sort of an homage to the past of the Opera House. We want to thank you for joining us today for this behind the scenes glimpse of the reconstruction project here at the Opera House Theatre and the future Newport Performing Arts Centre.